Hello fruit lovers, I've just been out here munching away on my Everglades tomatoes and this is the type you want to grow if you're growing tomatoes in Florida. Um, you can get tomatoes that are determinate or indeterminate tomatoes. The determinate will grow and then die. The indeterminate keep growing and keep growing. But in Florida, there's always some sort of bug, there's always some sort of disease that attacks them. But the Florida Everglades tomato loves growing in this dappled light. I don't give them any, any, hardly any water, no food, just let them go all by themselves. They're just like a weed. In fact, I have to cut this back because it smothers my, it keeps going out and covering over my seedlings. Um, you can even see it, it's growing up into the oak tree. But these are fantastic tasting. They're only small tomatoes but nice taste. None of that watery stuff you get in the shops. And of course these are grown without chemicals. So perfectly healthy. Exquisite. Great little snack to have. I mean, if you had kids, they'd be out here putting these off. Have, living, living a dream. All right, grow some yourself. Pretty easy. If I can do it, you can do it. Here's a little postscript to the Everglades tomato. You saw the video, most of the video, they were looking gorgeous, weren't they? Uh, but uh, we had some frost last night and um, this one is really beaten up. This one here that is more beneath the oak tree, uh, looks like it will make it through. It was obviously a lot more protected than the one that was out more in the open. So, uh, there's something there. You probably can't grow these in all of Florida.